of the case and drop those charges. Today, NBC Charlotte's Ty Chandler spoke with the man at the center of the case who claims it's all a misunderstanding. She joins us now live with more. Well, Sean Kilkenny says he did nothing wrong at this pool. In fact, he says he can't believe this whole thing even escalated to the point where someone would call the police. That was my first introduction to my brand new community and it was not very welcome. Sean Kilkenny says he just moved to Rock Hill from New Jersey and couldn't wait to show off his new digs. My first day going to the pool and I was excited to show my friends back home in New Jersey what the place looked like. With a GoPro camera strapped to him, he went for a swim but ended up making a lot of waves with his new neighbors who accused him of being a pool peeping Tom. It's just me swimming on the bottom. I wasn't filming anybody. Mm -hmm. I wasn't doing anything wrong. And the next thing you know, the cops take me away. I spent the weekend in jail because the offices are closed. Mm -hmm. So I slept on a concrete floor for my first weekend here. Rock Hill police say they did find pictures of women in bikinis at the pool on Kilkenny's phone, but the charges were dismissed. The York County solicitor says Kilkenny broke no laws since the pool is a public place and Kilkenny had a right to be there. In a statement, she says in part, while the alleged conduct is perhaps concerning and distasteful, it does not rise to the level of criminal conduct. But neighbors aren't convinced. Even though it is a public place, you know, I feel like there's certain rules you ought to abide by mm -hmm. and I don't feel comfortable in somebody uh, filming you or taking pictures of you without your permission. The fact that it got thrown out gives me some vindication, but that doesn't mean that all these people around aren't looking at me like I'm some weirdo because I'm not. Well, on a day like this, Kilkenny says he would have liked to have gone to the pool, but after everything he's gone through in the last few days, he says he'd rather stay home. In Rock Hill, I'm Ty Chandler. NBC Charlotte. All right, Ty, thanks for that report. Right now, authorities are searching for a woman who was staying in Rock Hill and went missing.